Hi folks, this is Gordon from Beaks FX. I um, wanted to do a short online demo of a new re-released, rewritten Palm application. So what is it? Palm is a little desktop application that we've written, uh, meaning peace of mind. That's what it stands for and it's all about rebooting your MT4, getting them automatically started in the event of any VPS issue, any server issue our side. Or even if the um, terminal.exe itself gets into a little bit of trouble. So it's a fairly simple little application. Let's have a quick look at it. So I've already installed it on a desktop. Here we've got a VPS sitting in our um, London data center. So let's open up Palm. You just double click on it. So there it is. Um, a little start, um, a little Windows application. So if you've got the load at startup box text, um, you'll need to put your username and your password in. That is your VPS username and your VPS password um, to get that enabled. And when you've got that load at startup box ticked, it means your applications will load when the VPS is started, the ones that are under control by Palm. So, um, how do you get an application under POMS control? Very simple. Drag and drop it. When you drag and drop it. So there we've got the FXCM MetaTrader um, instance in there and the Pepperstone instance in there. Um, and uh, as you can see, it is automatically starting them. Um, that's FXCM opened. And uh, the startup delay is set to 10 seconds, so that means um, it'll wait for a 10 second interval between starting up the instances of your MT4. You don't want them all starting at the same time. If you've got 10 or 12 MT4 instances um, and you reboot your VPS, you want to stagger that start so you're not causing load issues on the VPS itself. So this uh, field's configurable. You can change it to 60 seconds, change it to 4. You can do whatever you like with it. But it default's 10. And let's leave it at that. Um, also, we've got a mail alert to section. So you just put in your email address that you want any Palm alerts sent to. Oh, I can't type. Um, and that will send alerts on the event of issues in the VPS. So I've just set up a quick Gmail account so we can have a look at that working as well. So at the moment, we've got FXCM and MetaTrader, uh, FXCM and Pepperstone under Palm's control. You can change which um, bits first by going up, going down. So that'll take my FXCM into the second in the boot queue. Um, you've got a log of everything that happens in POM. So there you can see me messing around with the settings there. Um, so let's clear the log. Okay. Um, so as you see, POM automatically auto started Pepperstone and FXCM so if you inadvertently close down a, an MT4 when you're in the VPS and it's under POMS control it'll just automatically restart it again in, in 10 days so let's say uh, crash the VPS I'll just uh, power it off in vSphere um, give me one second Okay, so that's POM, that's the uh, VPS, sorry, being turned off. No graceful shutdown, the power's just pulled, so this will simulate a, a VPS crash. So, in the next 30 or 45 seconds, you'll get the, we'll get the little message that no one likes to see, and that is that the network's not able to pick up your VPS. And that's 9.19. So, there we go. VPS is gone. Crashed. Now, let's power it back on. Let me do that from vSphere. That'll take a, a minute or two to power back on and for um, things to restart. So, in the meantime, let's have a look at... Um, how you get POM. Yeah, anyone can use this. This is not just for Beaks customers. We'll just put it on the website. 
So just Google Beaks FX support. There you go. I'll bring up a support page. Just go to getting started. Form application. Some install instructions. And if you scroll to the bottom, that's the .exe. So when you're in your VPS, just go to that URL or, or Google it and um, download it straight onto the desktop. Follow the instructions to install the application and uh, you'll get it on the, on the VPS as I just showed you. It's all very simple. So, I want to give it a minute or two just to um, to get the VPS restarted. So, and then we can uh, log back in. Let's do that now. That's me just logging back in. So there we go, back into the VPS. You can see FXCM, Pepperstone. Both restarted. And there you go, your little message that um again not a, a particularly popular one popular one but that showed that um there's an unexpected shutdown in the vps um, but as you can see your mt4s are, are back online and there you go so in your log you can see the terminal.exe is getting restarted and then there you go the 10 second delay 20 56 2106 so that's showing it automatically restarting so there's another fe feature that i want to show you that um we'll use this project one icon for so we put that little application under the control of palm so this is a little application we've built that um, will become non-responsive so Let's just boom and get it running. So you can see in Task Manager, Project 1 is not responding. So this is simulating a, an MT4 hang. Could be an, a, an EA has crashed, something's gone wrong, um, and your terminal is not responding. So, so we've set this up so that um after 30 seconds of an a, a one of the applications under palm not responding palm will automatically restart it reboot the application and will send you a notification as well so you can see it's still not responding in a few seconds we'll see that getting rebooted There we go. Tracks that get closed, being closed. Now restarted. And all's good. So if that went back into a non responsive state, Palm would again try and clear it and reboot it. Um, and it would email you. So let's um, go and just have a quick look at the little email account that I set up. So there you go. Um, telling you that the Applications not responded and not responsive and, and has restarted. Um, so that will be an MT4, not obviously the project one.exe. That's just there to to simulate load. Um, so you you know if your if your MT4 is running overnight um, and you wake up to a load of errors in your inbox, you know that you've had problems with your your broker platform uh, while you've been sleeping. So there's a few other feature functions on here. Um, you know, if if you go to close the VPS as opposed to log off, Palm will flag it. Um, and and other than that, you know, it's it's a handy little Windows application. As I say, available to anyone who wants to use it. It's been re-released, so if anyone's got ideas on how to improve it, any more feature functions they want added in, drop us a note. We're always happy to have a look at it. Um, so that's us, folks. Happy trading. Thanks. Bye.